I reviewed several Nespresso compatible pods on the channel already. Um, this is a classic favorite from uh, many, especially uh, Europeans. This is the Illy brand. They're aluminum capsules. I'm just going to compare the Intenso version versus the Forte. And unlike some other uh, brands where, you know, it's hard to tell the difference between their different uh, levels, there's definitely a difference between the Intenso and the Forte. And uh, I'll go over that in a second. Uh, I'll also compare, you know, how their capsules, a lot of people concern how their capsules are going to work in the classic line. They're few different classic line models. Not all capsules work well. You can see some of my other uh, reviews. They don't all work well with the classic line. I can tell you that Illy, I've never had a problem uh, in terms of like water coming out first or any issues with lost pods falling down, nothing like that. But there actually is a difference uh, in, in the uh, between an original Nespresso that you see here and the Illy pods. This is another Nespresso. One of the big differences you'll notice is that, if I can get the camera to zoom in, Illy Pod is a bit flatter, whereas the Nespresso Pod will come to a, a head, like a cone shape a bit more. If you look pretty closely, again, now the camera's not zoomed, but this is a flatter uh, head and top. The size, uh, this is almost identical or it is identical, I would say. Um, so that's not an issue. And again, even though it's a different, slightly different shape, I've never had an issue with it falling down or getting water first. So um, I did notice, and I'll, I'm gonna do the demonstration for both. I got two glasses here. They do come out a little bit slower compared to a, a real Nespresso. And I think that still has to do with uh, Illy's uh, grinds. And I've had an issue with the traditional non-espresso machine, you know, the traditional espresso machine. I did a whole review on that, how my Illy, you know, out of a can didn't work in my uh, Nespresso, in my Nespresso machine at the time. Anyway, back to this, I'm going to do the, show you the uh, crema. I'm going to show you, uh, you know, go through the, what I, you know, the difference in the taste that I think, but um, definitely wanted to show you this and make sure you know that uh, these do work. That's always a concern. So won't stall it anymore, but in general, uh, you know, a little bit of a spoiler, but you know, the difference being obviously it is one is strong, it's supposed to be stronger than the other, and it definitely is. And I would say if you are using, uh, you're, you're making um, any kind of uh, lattes or uh, cappuccinos, anything with milk or, any, you know, and, and that can be any type of milk, dairy or otherwise, I personally would go with the Forte. There's a huge difference. I mean, this is very, um, it's a, it's a, it's a smooth coffee and I, I know people use that word but it, it, it goes down easy it's not acidic and it's tasty whereas this is a lot more this is a bolder this is going to come through the uh, any kind of milk product or whatever you're putting in creamers um, whereas it could get lost with the uh, in, intenso but first let me just show you how they the crema and the process and how they come out uh, pretty well this is going to heat back up so you'll see no water came out first it's instant but it's a little bit of a thinner stream and it takes a little bit longer but i think that's again i think that's their i think they use very very fine grinds compared to some other brands nonetheless i'm already getting the uh the smells smells delicious and does taste delicious. Both do, by the way, both the Forte and the Intenso, it's just different. If you're gonna drink straight up espresso shots, you might enjoy this. If you like it a little bit stronger, you'll go with the Forte, but certainly if you're gonna be adding any of those liquids to it, milk, creamers, whatever, the Forte is the way to go, in my opinion. So we'll let this drip down a little bit. I'm gonna show you the crema. Almost at two layers there. Not a huge amount, but there is something. Um, hopefully you get that, and then I'll do a quick taste test after. Is that coming through? How much? So not a whole lot. Definitely a thin little layer. And then this is the intense one. By the way, this is how they come packed. And there's two up top here that stick out. One here, one here, and then these are in there. Actually, the same exact way that the 
Lavazas uh, are packed for some reason with these holders. All right, here comes the Intenso. Let that drip out a little bit. And we'll check the crema. Crema looks almost identical to the other, which is no surprise. Same type of beans, by the way. And let's take a look. There that is. All right, quick taste test. This is the Intenso. In the forte. Again, you know, I've, I've tasted them before, but definitely much more intense, a little bit more bitter, bolder. Um, so uh, I stand by it. If you're going to be drinking a straight shot uh, with little to no milk, uh, uh, you know, you don't even need sugar really for this. Uh, depending on how you like it. If you even normally take sugar, you can tolerate this without sugar. It's um, it's just a nice, it's a bit sweeter. Whereas this is a, just a darker bowler, just exactly what it says, stronger uh, espresso or espresso in an espresso machine. So this was a nice, short and sweet um, but you know the, the highlights are, even though it is a different shape than the original espresso, um, they do work. I've never had a failure. I've never had water come out first. Taste, um, you know, as good as this as a, an Illy. Illy is made, you know, used all around the world in different cafes. You can get it yourself um, with these capsules. As far as pricing, um, they're normally like um, you can get them a dollar or eighty-five cents a capsule. If you buy them in bulk but i did find a seller on amazon 55 cents came out to 55 cents or 50 cents each capsule so i'll leave a link down for them um if, look if you found this all helpful please do give it a thumbs up if you'd like to see more subscribe down below if you want to see some of the other um nespresso compatible videos check those out and i thank you for joining me